Hi everybody, my name is Liz Magnanti and I'm from The Birdhouse in Rochester, New York. And today I'm talking about how you can attract mason bees to your backyard. And mason bees are a great type of insect to attract because they're a native, non-stinging, pollinating species that actually will pollinate your plants better than honeybees do. And you can attract them easily by putting out a mason bee house. And mason bee houses are simple structures they're filled with little tunnels, so most of the time they are little bamboo shoots or they are little paper straws. And the female mason bee will find these out, They'll, she'll search these out, and inside of there she'll lay an egg. And inside there she'll also put some nectar and some pollen, and then she'll cap it off. And that egg will hatch soon after she lays it, and out of that egg will come the larva. The larva will eat that nectar and the pollen packet that she's left for them. And then it'll pupate, and that pupa will stay inside the house all summer, all fall, all winter. And then in the spring, they'll hatch out and they will pollinate your garden. And they can visit as many as a thousand blooms per day. So they're a really great pollinating species. They are what's called a solitary bee, so they don't build a big hive like a honeybee does. But they will pollinate your garden all spring long. They live about four to six weeks and um, putting out a mason bee house is a great way to attract these bees. And you want to make sure that when you're placing your house to put it somewhere where it is against a flat surface. They don't like something that moves around a lot. So you want to make sure it's on the side of a fence or possibly a tree that gets a lot of sunlight. And if you can post it somewhere where it gets a lot of south or southwest exposure, that is your best bet. And there's other resources that we have here at the Birdhouse where you can learn to attract mason bees. So feel free to visit our website at thebirdhouseny.com for more information on how you can attract them to your backyard.